Sinead McInespy, all the way from Monaghan. First of all, tell me your connections at home. Which McInespy are you? Um, so I'm a daughter of Jerry McInespy um, and he's brother of Aidan. I'm sure like, most people would know Aidan McInespy. Yeah, so I'm a niece. And tell me about all the other cousins who play the football all over Ireland and all over the world. Um, well, the McInespy side, yeah, there's a few of us. Um, I have a cousin in Perth. She's playing for St. St. Fimbers. Um, I had a cousin, she played for us Penrith last year, she just went home. Um, and then I have a brother in New Zealand, he plays for Christchurch McKenna's. Um, most of them are still back at home though, they're playing for either Monaghan or Trone, depending on what side of the border they're at. <laughs> well not go there, since yeah. we're on the other side of the world, but tell me this, you're with Penrith, why Penrith? Um, so I originally left home and I was living in Christchurch, New Zealand. Um, and before I had even left New Zealand, Teresa Connolly Hughes, Caroline McCurry, Neve McCurry, fellow Monaghan ladies, got wind that I was coming to Sydney. Um, and the recruitment over here is very uh, competitive. So once they got in contact with me and I heard, I heard all the stories about Penrith being a great club. Um, some of my teammates from Christchurch had played for Penrith um, and they recommended them. They said they were a great bunch. So that was my choice. <laughs> Those are sort of things you would hear about most clubs, but what makes this club a bit different? Um, I guess, well, most clubs they are a mix of all over Ireland you know we don't really have a strong hold of one particular county and um, so we do have that good balance um, in dialects if you want to say uh, different just 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 different crack but um, no it's a great it's a great club and I guess why it's a wee bit different is we're probably one of the smaller ones like in terms of the ladies anyway and um, the ladies was only formed a year before I came over so Whenever you're involved in something like that, that means quite a lot. Um, I think that makes you want to stay and just like do a wee bit better every year. And how did today go? What was the importance of today? Um, so this was the second year that the Penrith um, Gales had ran the tournament. Um, we had got rained off a couple of years and, and so it was really important that we got this year up and running and um, everything ran smoothly. Um, for the girls as well, we've had a lot of new players and um, so it was all about getting them comfortable playing with each other um, and we got to the semi-final so we were really happy with that. What about the two clubs in one, if I can put it that way? You've all the young players in them, including you and that, um, who are playing and living around the Sydney area and then you have this older generation here who are from Belfast, from Dublin, they've been here since the 70s, since the 80s and they're so proud to have you guys coming out and playing in their area. Yeah, no they are, they're super proud and I think that we're extremely lucky that we have that kind of deeper connection. Um, so the Penrith Dales are celebrating the 45th year this year um, and to have the likes of John um, and the, the older guys out in Penrith here, do you know they're a great support for us, um, they come to all of our finals, they support us with everything um, for all our functions throughout the year, um, they invite us out, we come out here a couple of times a year and it's great, um, it's just having that like extra layer of support whenever you're so far away from home. And that deeper connection as you put it is a nice way of putting it, it's like another level of Irishness if that's the way to yeah, it is. And um, like John and the guys, they're very proud of the club and, and how far it's come. Um, and obviously, like there's been so many people have played through the club and, and they're still here and they're still really proud of it. Um, so that, that deeper connection and having them there, it is, it's really important for us.